going on guys? Welcome back to the Rice and Miata YouTube channel. Why don't you sit back, grab some popcorn, and enjoy the video? Ah! Nice! Fire, dude. All right, boys, well, you guys know we're gonna be doing some pretty big upgrades to this scooter soon. I'm really excited about it, but before it becomes really fast and really snappy, if you watched the last video, my new impulse is doing wheelies, and I'm not gonna lie, I tried at least, what do you think, 200 wheelies yesterday? Oh, yeah. Dude, my arms from trying to throw this thing up hurt so bad, but I have no chill. Like, I feel like I have arthritis in my middle finger because I only hold it like this. It's just comfy for me. But we're gonna give it a try. Today we're on an uphill. We're gonna give it like 30 minutes and see what we can come up with. It's kind of too slow for the uphill. Yeah. Like, I don't have any power for it. Different spot. advice even though I don't know you're not committing enough you're picking the bike up and then your helmet is so close to the speedo you think I have to just lean, lean back. your whole head back okay. you I know head back dude head and neck back yeah! Fuck, I'm doing it again. Dude, this is a nice little setup right here. Buy this house. For sale? It's a little run down, dude. Needs a paint job. It's the balance for me. The balance is hard. We'll switch it around. We got a car. Y'all taking notes? I know I am, dude. Nice little food plot right there, dude. Looks good. Yo! That, that was, was fire! I just wish I could hold it, you know? But once we have that torque, that will help me because I'll be able to give it a little more gas. It'll pop back up. But good momentum, we That was good. I'm happy with that one, but let's keep her going. Oh, you should have gassed it. It's hard, dude. Damn. Well, courtesy to the Suron, nice little camera rig. Quiet, fast, nimble. Jesus! But I dump it! Open anything when you're going fast, it's so hard. Because that, that was floored. Literally floored. Dude, downhill sketch. So sketch.
Oh my god, you're gonna put that fucker in the ditch. What do we got here? For sale? Yo, you trying to buy that shit? Maybe. Let's go up there. Dude, this plot of land is for sale. Land for sale in Torrington is kind of rare. Dude, it's like already started. Definitely good for the land crews to live up here. Yeah. Kind of be left alone. No, this is nice. This is a perfect area. Yeah. That's kind of why we're here. We're not bothering anyone. There's so like quiet. Very few houses. Don't wheelie in front of houses and just like we're minding our own business, you know? Yeah, this is sick, this dude. This is sick, though. I might call the guy and see. He's probably. This is probably 200k, dude. Yeah, for one acre. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is a beautiful neighborhood. So nice up here. Yeah. Well, let me know how much it is. We'll go half. Oh yeah. Maybe. You got 50 G's? The bank does. That was sick. Dude, this might be more than one acre. Dude, it's all on a hill though, you can't do much with it. Yeah, you could do, you just gotta blast it out. With what, C4? No, look at uh, Andrew Camerata. Okay. He did all that on his own. Can you do endo with this? Yes. I'm feeling a good one with the payment tape. Oh my god. Oh dude. There's another for sale sign right there. It said three acres. Huh? It's three acres. Oh that's not bad. Yeah, not bad at all. For for Torrington now it's it's probably 150, 120. I gotta delete that break, dude. I'm a pussy. No, you need that. Oh my god, up in someone's lawn. Feeling it at, at this pole, dude? Pull the pole, I'm feeling it. Pull the pole, let's see it. Pull the brake! Ah! Uh. That was decent. cruiser day today. I think Ruddy's about to install the new freshly painted fender flares and I don't know if in this video there's some stuff to unbox that's all I'm gonna say. I don't know what his plan is. He's smiling. He might be doing it today. I don't know what he got either. I was just saying that there's a bunch of stuff that you didn't tell me what it was that needs to be unboxed. Yeah we're not gonna get to that yet. We wow. Have to, we have to do the work first so we got the over fenders painted. I haven't done it yet. I've been meaning to do it this month because at the end of the month, my family and I were going camping and I'm gonna bring the Land Cruiser. I think it's a perfect opportunity to practice with it. You know, my mom's a good camper. I'll be honest, I'm not a camper, but I watch van life. I think it's cool. I love overlanding. It's fun. 
me personally, I've never really been camping. Yeah. So this is like my grand thing. Like, am I gonna like this or is it just a fad for me? We're gonna find out. I think you'll like it. I think I'm gonna it's love gonna it. It's gonna be sick. Dude, I've absolutely like, just the idea of just like chilling in the wilderness, like no stress, no problem, maybe go fishing. Like, yeah. it just seems relaxing. I feel like everything is just so fast paced in life. Oh yeah. I think it's sometimes cool to just slow it down a bit and just drop everything, forget everything and make peace. I like that. You know? I like so, that. So, step one, let's get the overfenders out. Let's take a gander. Look at that, dude. Look at that. This is right here. I wish you can just like pop it on and be done, you know? It's a little more in depth than that. This doesn't have like the rubber, which is kind of annoying. I'm gonna have to work it a little bit. It looks a lot better with the over fender though. Yeah, it does. Definitely stoked. I have to get them all out or get these two out and then check. I'm pretty sure this box came with new hardware, so we'll look into that too. All right, so we gotta do the boring stuff first. So obviously we have the new piece right here Then we have the old piece. I'm just gonna, it's got like some internal skeleton going on in here so we're just gonna pop that off just put it on this and then figure out how it goes on i didn't take this off but it's probably pretty self-explanatory i wish maybe we can glue that back i would like this to go on we'll figure that out in a second though so while ruddy is figuring out the puzzle of piecing all the clips and stuff together you could see right there bags of clips and hardware and whatnot. He stabbed his finger with a screwdriver. Now he's dropping the soap, literally. Yo, I dropped the soap. Yeah, you really did. Now it's, <laughs> I gotta fish that out, dude, when I cook tonight. Oh, sorry, dude. Well, he's doing that. Matt is getting the 180 prepared to be taken off the jack stands. As you can see, it's been sitting on jack stands in the background of the videos for quite a while, but Rudnick doesn't want to like leave the spot. He doesn't want to push the car outside without the valve cover on, the oil pan on, because it's exactly how it was. I don't know if you could see that, not enough lighting, but there's no oil pan on it, no valve cover on it. So Matt is cleaning up the, like the oil pan and stuff, had all that debris in it. If y'all remember that video. Getting all the metal out. Yeah, we got Matt on the parts cleaner. Excuse the poor lighting, but yeah, that's what's going on at this current moment. How's it going? Not very good, it's completely different. What do you mean? These stupid over fenders, dude, like, so. You can see this one has more overhang right here. So if you fucking put it on the truck, it doesn't fucking even line up, dude. I, this what? is the prime example of like you shouldn't paint something before. Yeah. Paid fucking four hundred dollars get the. I'm pissed uh, actually right now. Like I'm gonna make it work, but you can see once you line this up, it's just a oh, little off. man. Which, it, honestly, you probably won't notice it too much now that I talked about it and, you know, but I'm just an honest guy, you know, yeah. but I'm a little pissed and the fucking mounting is just completely different. Like this one, this one has these mounting points to where you can kind of clip it in. Show me where those are. Non-existent, I see. Those are. Yeah. I put all of these in. Only two of the holes line up oh, in the truck. Oh, no. And like, I'm not about to go fucking drill more holes in my truck, dude. Yeah. So, have a, having a little bit of a BF at the moment. A little so. bit of a BF, just, yeah. Just a little bit of a BF, but we'll, we'll get it situated. Well, well um, he's having his BF out here. Matt is under the 180, attaching the lower oil pan. Wait. Also not having a good time. No, because the bolts, there's the oil lines between the, like the pan and the bolt, and you can ba barely jam it through. It sucks. Well, definitely not a good day. Out here at the Rodnock Mod Shop, so far the wheelies was the only thing really positive about this, unfortunately. It's looking up, dude. We're getting one on. It's not tight yet, but seems like it's gonna fit pretty good. Let me tighten this in, see if that looks better, because right now that looks like a hunk of dog shit. Looks good from here. Looks good from your house. It's quite far away. How's the door piece coming along? This one's a little weird, so we got that one. That one's all good, but I'm just trying to understand how these actually get like locked into place because these two tabs right here, 
They go into there, and this pin, or this clip, works perfectly into there. But we need something up here, but this doesn't line up. Mm. So I'm trying to figure out a different method for these, because this is just shit. This doesn't work at all. Yeah. And trying to figure out, I'm about to figure out if I can find something similar to this, and try to almost like, I don't know, just figure it out. I don't, I don't know. Well. <laughs> Yeah, this this part works. This part's good. It just bolts up to here. That's all good. But this doesn't line up with that one. And we're getting there. Yeah. I did a test fit. It was about 80% there, not 100. I would like to be at 95%. Yeah. I'm not looking for 100, but 95, I'd be proud of. You know? So hopefully next clip it's on. All right. Well, while he's still working on that debacle, uh, Matt is editing and he got the 180 done. As you can see, it is finally off the jack stands, ready to give the lift space back. While all that's going down, I'm whipping up a little dinner here. Look at this beautiful steak, microgreen salad, the fresh peppers and mushrooms, dude, all cooked on the cast iron. Y'all already know. All right, nice little dinner. Quite satisfied. Ruddy almost done out here, I hope. The home stretch, baby, the home stretch. So I've had to riv nut everything. The thing, that piece that we were talking about earlier, I don't know why, I just guess I'm tired, but there were rivets and the rivets were just like broken inside. So I ended up drilling out the rivets and then putting riv nuts onto the car, riv nutting everything on and then getting some hardware and stuff. And now we're just working with the front. I put a riv nut here, I put a riv nut in the front and nothing really lines up, so I'm hoping that there's a mounting point here, a mounting point here, and a mounting point below. I'm hoping that it's gonna suck it up enough. I do wanna order that shit, because especially over there, I don't know if this is just bad over fenders, but we can't, I can't get the front of the rear to fit good, well, good enough to my liking, but I think that rubber shit will hide a lot. Yeah. You know, so it'll hide a lot of the mistakes. I need to get a rubber wheel, pop all this stuff off, but right now I'm just trying to get everything to fit, because these, aren't the same at all. They looked the same. Yeah, they did look very similar. Until you looked at the mounting and it was just an absolute debacle. So hopefully this is the last test fit and then we're gonna be fucking Gucci dude to yeah. some wheelies and celebrate, you know? Sounds good. And while Chris is finishing this up, as you see, the truck is not here. Matt took the dually to bring the E30 back. So yeah, I, we'll, we'll see what happens with that. We've been working on the E30. I'm trying not to be too scatterbrained with it, you know, like, I don't want to just, okay, we got a trans in, now it moves. Like, I want to want to actually get that the E30 done. You know, like, we started that project. We might as well try our very best to fix all of that stuff. We'll talk more about the E30 when, when it, gets it actually here. gets here. Because yeah. right now my brain's focused on getting these rib nuts in. All right, so after test fitting the front over fender, turns out that we're definitely going to need, like, some sort of mounting right here. So I actually, you probably can't see it. Oh, you can see it right there. I did put an insert, but the other over fender, it bolted up to this hole over here. So hopefully the plan is, we're just gonna use some of this shit. This is solely for marking. Oh my God, that looks like a like a skateboard wheel. Shit, I guess so. I guess this has an expiration date. Hold on, wait. Remind me again. Stir it up a little bit. I was like, yeah, this shit's gonna work perfect. Solidified. Yeah. All right, so. In theory, what I'm trying to do, I just want to touch the top of the bolt here without touching the fender. Oh, don't fall, bitch. And then, what I want to do is I want to line this one up. I'm gonna get that in. And then, just push that on, you know? And hopefully, yeah, you see that? You see the fender, dude? You yep, see that little I hole? I do, I do. I'm gonna fucking grab a drill bit and fucking shove her right through there. And then, I can get my hand, I just gotta get it a little more down. It really hurts my wrist, but we can make it happen. So now, pull that off, we'll pull the whole thing off, we'll drill that out, and then hopefully, this will be done. This will be done, we can put the fog light in, we can finally, we'll open the boxes tomorrow, because by the time I finish this, yeah, it's gonna be dark. Be dark. Yeah. I honestly didn't think this was gonna take that long. It's been a while. It's been a while, Couple hours at but least. But, I'm honest, other than this piece, I don't even wanna show you this piece, it's so bad. But, other than this piece, I'm actually quite happy with how everything came out. I mean, you can see this is obtruding a little bit. I found a clip that kind of works for right here. But once again, I feel like once we get that, oh, Matt back with the E30. I thought that was Matt for it. Yeah, uh, no, the sound wasn't right though. Yeah, I'll just bring it in that over there for now. Dang, she's bad. Yes, who's bad? 
but yeah, anyways, I think that shit will make it a lot better and it'll hide a lot. Don't get too close, dude. Like, <laughs> like it's dumb because I've literally worked on this panel for over an hour. It's been, like, it's and been quite some time. I've riv nutted it, I tried to do everything, but you know, some things happen. She's finally done. Is this actually completed? Yeah, I'm a little pissed about this right here. You got a little flex there, but I have to take it off again because obviously I don't have an eraser wheel with me. So I'm gonna take it off again. I just didn't want to go to advance right now and do all of that and wanted to test fit this anyways. But the brackets are like the plastic, I'll just show you. So like some of these, some of them are really tight. So for example, this is a tight one, but some of them are really loose. For example, the one that I just drilled out, that plastic is a little loose. So what I think is happening right now, I'm going to tighten the little stud and it's just spinning inside of there. So tomorrow when we actually go to put it on for good, I'll probably put like a little JB weld on just the back of the plastic. So like the stud is actually like bonded to the over fender. So then once it's not just spinning in there because dude, you have to fucking go all the way in here. My fucking whole arm hurts. And Do you think actually this is from the rubber? Like yeah. the rubber being so thick? That you know? it looks like double-sided tape. So look at this, and then let's look at the other side. I'm more concerned with this, because I feel like this is a different angle. You got it in your head? Yeah. All right, now let's look at the other side. Yeah, that's definitely from the rubber. You think so? You think they're about the same? Yeah. Where can I get this? Like, I don't even know what that is. Like, I mean, what I, do you look up to find over fender rubber trim? I mean, I, over fender rubber trim. <laughs> <laughs> <You know? laughs> I think you just glue this on. I mean, correct me if I'm wrong, I don't know if it's because to hide the seam or to Probably, the or no, water. yeah, to not let water get in there. Maybe a little bit of both. But like, even if there's water that came in, there's plenty of like, holes to like, yeah. you know, for the water to come out. It's probably to not trap salt in and stuff like that. Yeah, it's probably just to hide the seam as well. Another thing is, what compound do you use to like, glue this on, you know? I use that Gorilla Glue shit. Remember you called me out for gluing the skirts on the 36? Is it working? Yeah. Yeah? Oh yeah. I just feel like that shit's kind of messy, you know? Like, yeah, it's a little messy. You put a little too much, you push this down, it's just oozing yeah. around, you it know? Does. It you had a lot does. more contact area to yeah. play with rather than that. Yeah, it took a little longer than I expected, but this has been on my chopping block for a couple weeks now, and I'm happy that I finally fucking sacked up and did it. You know, it's a big step in the right direction. Now, next part of the vlog, we can open the boxes. That's where the fun stuff. I yeah. wanted to do the, the stuff that I knew I would hate first. Like, I'm not even going to open those boxes until we get all of the crud off, get that fog light or that corner light on end up get that all fixed because once that's done it's to the fun stuff yeah so with that being said i'm gonna park this thing i'm gonna practice some more wheelies so see you in a bit so matt's taking off right now to go bring the trailer back to the office he just unloaded the e30 here she is back at home looking good definitely looking good so i'm not sure what the exact plan is here I'm assuming we're gonna have to either push it over there or limp it over there. I don't even know the full story about this car or like why does it run like shit or whatever. Hey. I'm coming over to talk about it with you. Now, so I think where we ended last video was we were trying to scan it. Yep. And it wasn't working. Turns out you can't scan a car when it doesn't have a very good battery, at least with the stock you see yep. and stuff like that. So we ended up putting a fresh battery in it. And at first it had like a ton of codes. It had a bunch of injector codes, a bunch of misfire codes. We cleared it and then all of those codes went away. It started running better. And now the only code that we have is a cam sensor. Jordan told me that sometimes it can be a little finicky. Like before I go to replace it, unplug it, plug it back in, rescan it, do all of that stuff. So that's probably gonna be our first order of business. Once we have no codes, we gotta do something about the exhaust. Um, yeah. I had an exhaust made a while back. It, it just sits really low. So I'm gonna have to do something about that. So I wanted to get it to the shop, just look at everything, make sure everything is tight, go over the engine bay one more time. It's been a while since we worked on this car. So before we go get this thing, like I'm gonna say detuned because it makes 500 horsepower right now and I want it to make like 350. Um, before we do any of that, I obviously want to be prepared, make sure it's good. Yeah, I guess that's kind of it. Should I try a wheelie on this? Uh, yeah. You were doing some wheelies today. No, it's, that's way easier to pop up than the Vino. It's way easier to pop up, but it's way more dangerous. I think. Yo, for sure. No! <laughs> uh, that's it. That's all she wrote. I'm over that. We're back. Day two of putting some over fenders on. I know, it probably shouldn't be day two, but 
here we are. Do you know how much this thing was, dude? No. I already told you, $37. $37. I did not expect this to be $37, but we got this. I went to Harbor Freight, I got some goo gone. I don't really think we even need this, but I don't have any at the shop, and I feel like it's kind of a good thing. Yeah, it's definitely know? not bad, it'll last a while. And then we also got some epoxy quick setting, because um, remember we were talking about that little thing that I wanted to epoxy, so we're gonna take the over fender off right now. Wait a minute, is that fake JB Weld? When you squeeze those out, we're zooming in on it. Because if if one tube is gray and one tube is white, that's fake JB Weld. It's the same stuff. It's budget. Yeah, no, it is. It's all it made is. in the same. It was a dollar thirty nine. No, it's just funny that it's like a ripoff. Well, I bought the forty dollar fucking rubber wheel, so I had to save with the fake JB Weld. Fake JB Weld, you know? dude. So we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna pull Wait. that off. We're gonna get that this all this shit off. Cause this is just fucking disgusting. And then hopefully once we um, use this stuff, we'll be able to tighten this more cause that was a problem if you guys remember. Well, you probably remember better than me cause it was like the last clip, but let's take it off. What do you think? I'm hoping I see gray and white. Oh, it's clear. Oh, it's not dude. Different formula dude. It's not budget dude. No. This might be the real deal. Oh yeah, we'll see. <laughs> so it fucking broke the tab, which I'm insanely annoyed about. So hopefully we can repair that, or just repair it enough to the point where... Oh damn, both of them are clear. Yeah, that's kind of weird, isn't it? A little bit. That's about half and half, yeah? I think so. Ooh, it kind of smells like rotten eggs, huh? Does it? So it's the same smell as JB Ooh, Quick. Uh, Maybe it's the same formula as JB Weld without the dye. They yeah. didn't want to get sued. There's no coloring. You think that'll be able to fix this? If you cake it on. We made a fucking thermostat housing out of that shit and it worked. Did we put it in an oven after? I think so, yeah. We were trying to be like scientific. It worked. Let's see. Didn't leak. That is not enough. You don't think so? No. Why don't you just put the thing in and coat it, like make just it one it. piece. <laughs> Literally turn it into a one piece deal, yeah. Like now start caking the fuck out of it. How do you know if that's aligned though? Um, yep. Yep, yeah. This is AIDS. Nah, that'll work. You're gonna have to let that dry though. It says 15 minutes, dude. Definitely looks legit. Does it? Yeah. Does this look legit? You I know, mean, when you say sun looks legit, it kind of scares me. To why? Because <laughs> uh, no, like like usually that work. means it's probably not legit. Yeah, but it looks like it'll work. It says it bonds to plastic, metal, all of it. So. Perfect. Oh yeah, that's looking nice. You like it? Oh yeah. I think you need some more though. Yeah, you think so? Yeah. What? Yeah, you're gonna need to like make a solid layer around it. How annoying I have to do this. This is the piece it came with and it doesn't fit. What the hell, dude? Chinese, dude. China. Yeah, I blame everything on them. Three pets, dude. I don't, are you leaving that in? <laughs> I don't know, I'm just joking. They're bleep the pets, dude. <laughs> Ooh, they didn't want you to steal this one, dude. I mean, for $40, got a little anti-theft on it. For sure, dude, this is not an easy one to open. All right, so we got our little rubber wheel here. This thing better work. We'll use this one time, and he's like going like this. Like flat on it? Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> You're supposed to use the side, right? <laughs> we never used one before, I'm just watching him, dude, he's like, bro, what the fuck, man? This thing doesn't work. Oh, no. <laughs> Moment of truth here. Chair's rolling away. You don't want to scratch the paint on the fucking vert, yeah, dude. Yeah, that beautiful paint. Yeah. Huh? That'd be a real shame. Be oh, it's definitely it. working. Oh, for sure. All right, well, we'll cut back <laughs> when it's finished. Yeah, this I just don't want to go. I don't want to go too fast because I don't want to yeah. like burn in the paint or yeah, anything. Yeah, no, for sure. So, all right, we're gonna have no stickiness after. Yeah, hopefully. here we'll get a nice before of the full line. We'll see how good you can do. Film you drink your C in a C, dude. Yo, you know you're jealous. Yeah, cancer in a can, right don't there. Don't even lie, you're jealous. No, those dude. are fire. That's my favorite flavor. Don't I am jealous. Don't say they're cancer in a can. I would exactly love to be sponsored by Monster what one that day. Is. You know, odds are that will probably never happen. Yeah, well. Because I'm not like good enough at one thing to be sponsored by Monster. That's fair. You know what yeah, I mean? Like, I know exactly what I'm you mean. Okay, at a, a lot, lot of things. Of shit, yeah. 
but I'm not really good at oh, one dude, thing. Dude, imagine a monster livery on the Vino, dude. You get fired Yo, immediately. It's dude. like you're the bike life guy. <laughs> yeah, for that sure. That would be sick. If I got sponsored by Monster, I and I think it is a little boomer to do this, but like I would get a Monster tattoo. Dude. It's, it's a little, little boomer for it's sure. A little, it's a little boomer. It's a, I mean, <laughs> a little Kyle of you. Yeah. <laughs> but you sponsor, dude. You're bringing in, let's call it a hundred k a year, dude. Just in a sponsor, not yeah, too would, bad. Oh, that'd be yeah, sick. Part of your anyway. space. Yeah. yeah. What do you think? Looks good. It's not too bad. No, it looks nice. This is part of the paint. That's annoying. So this, I would. You missed the spot. See it? Oh, you're gonna be. You're gonna start critiquing now. No, I, you asked. You're the motherfucking critiquer, hey? You said, "How's it look?" That's fair. I appreciate you, man. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. We got the detail yeah, with the tandem there, collab. Go, yeah, dude. All right, the inspector, you're up, dude. What do you think? Oh, it looks good, oh, dude. Oh no, there's actually. Oh, see, now, oh, I'm now you're inspecting. There. You're double checking yourself. Careful, damn. Yo, chill. You're dude. applying a lot of I'm pressure to that paint. Dude. I'm kind of pissed. This thing's wearing out pretty fast, I mean, though. For forty bucks. Yeah, hey, that's what it's. What do I got? At, like I ten of these, and it's done. Probably. It's kind of AIDS, but all right. You can see the epoxy's already starting to work. I'm not gonna touch it crazy, but. It looks good. It's not bad. Yeah. I feel like we should let it dry for 20 minutes, put another fucking coat on it. Yeah. You know what I mean? That's the true Haggard spirit right <laughs> the there. The Hagnar yeah, right there. I like there. that. I like that. Because, <laughs> like, it, it can't hurt to have more, no, right? No, definitely not. Like, streak it. Like, fucking start over here and drag <laughs> yeah, it. Drag, yeah. Like, push it like a plow. Dude. Yeah. Like, you're like, it's like a <laughs> seam, dude. Like some fiber reinforcement. Dude. Yeah. Some grass or something. That's the Hagnar. Yeah, dude. Just throw some fucking random shit in it. Spitting no. it and shit, dude. No, no. don't <laughs> spit. Yeah, dude, just. <laughs> We're having a crisis right now. Downtown Saba Shop closed, yeah, right? Yeah, correct. Went to Big Y the other day, 40 bucks for like yeah, a I healthy lunch. I think it's incredibly lunch. overpriced. Incredibly overpriced. We're, we went to Price Right a couple weeks ago. And with you Damien. said it sucked. It sucked. The quality dude. was ass. We're kind of running out of places. We're going to have to go all the way uptown yeah. for our lunch today and um we're gonna have to see because i was so like used to stop and shop yeah, downtown yeah. grab a steak they're usually on sale yeah you know it's not the best meat but it's not the worst meat mm -hmm. you know no, so the meat you're getting from big y is top notch it's top notch but it's 23 dollars for dude. one single steak. for one steak i paid 23 yeah. dollars and i got three peppers and some greens and i paid 40 dollars yeah it's it's taxed absolutely disgusting so sounds like market 32 time yeah, Market 32, we're gonna see if they got anything better because I'm about to go to Costco and just get a freezer and just start buying my meat in bulk at this point. You have a freezer. Yeah, but I'm buying bulk, bulk. I don't know you how know much I mean? bulk you're gonna- like, You can't- hundred pounds? You ain't gonna fill that freezer. hundred pounds. Get a deer or something. Go hunt a deer, you'll have free no, meat. No, I'm cool with the- I, I'm happy that people like hunting. I'm not against it. Yeah. But like me personally, unless like the grid goes down tomorrow, like I'm not gonna go kill animals. You that's know? fair. It's just not. Yeah, that's like, fair. I'll eat them well, for sure, but I don't want to cut that thing open, rip its heart. That's not. That's not that's me. Good skill. skill. If I had to, I would. Yeah. It's but good I'm skill not to gonna learn. do it for a sport. Not knocking anyone that does it. You do you. Yeah. But like, I don't really well, give you, a fuck to do that. You should see if Anton's got some spare. Oh, oh Anton wants me to go live in the woods with him for a night. Yeah, that sounds sick. Yeah. yeah we'll see. It. No tent, no nothing. He's like, yeah, we're gonna bring one tarp and we're gonna have to make a mud castle. Like, yeah, that's called. Oh, that's. What that's called is bushcrafting. Yeah, yeah, he wants to go bushcrafting. Yeah, it's sick. So stay tuned for that. I don't know if it's going to be main channel or Patreon, but Anton said he wants to do it. You were here. Didn't he say like fucking a month from now? Or yeah, so when, it's, when it's cold. Yeah, like yeah. He said it wants, he wants it to be painful for you. Yeah, no, he wants me to die. Yeah, that's what he not wants. die, but yeah. be very uncomfortable the whole time. Yeah, he wants to laugh at me. Yeah. And that's fine. I, I'll, I'm, I'm willing to risk it for the biscuit. Fair. So let's go Market 32. Dude, I ain't gonna lie, doesn't Market 32 look like it would be more expensive than Big Y? A little bit, yeah. Like, it definitely. looks like a fancy place. Inside looks fancier, too. I know. Look, look at that salmon up there, dude. Cool. We'll scope it out if it's still overpriced. Is there we a have... salmon day? I'm not opposed. Oh, I'm not opposed. Be a salmon day, dude. I'm not opposed. Been having a lot of steak lately. It's good to have fish once I in a while. I had, let's call I probably 12 pounds of steak in the last Recently, seven days. Yeah. Well, let's, let's check it out. Yeah, nice I'm place. saying. Visually, it's very nice looking. Very yeah, like this is a sure. super upscale. This is like, like the nicest grocery store we have. Yeah. Looks plus. So you got these ones you can oh. pick from. Oh, yes. What? Sprouts are good. Yeah. It's, it's I guess they're broccoli. Oh. Broccoli sprouts? You don't see a like broccoli sprout? No. Oh. It tastes like a little bit. Is that, is that Dude, cocktail this, sauce? Yeah, the cocktail sauce is included into it. I don't recommend this. Why? I shrimp our bottom feeders. 
<laughs> they're delicious. So that's fair. There's but... three servings in this. Yeah. 80 calories per serving. So 8, 16, 24, 240 calories. 14 grams of protein per serving. Yeah. So 28 and then 42. 42 you know, grams. I think you have to pull the digestive tract yeah. out. Yeah. Our, no, I just our oceans are dirty. Yeah. Our oceans are gross. Well, just if, they, if they haven't been like fully peeled, then I just eat them. Hey, if you're a real yeah, man, yeah. you just you eat them. You do you, man. You do you. I'm still getting a steak. This is just like a dude. Look at this. Snack. Get one of those. Yo, you cooking it? <laughs> I I mean, we need a real I'll grill. I'll eat that whole thing. Dude. We need an actual grill. Dude, what is this? Seven buck, dude. A pound. Yeah, you guys uh, <laughs> this is probably a four pound. Yeah. <laughs> this is my setup right now. Dude, so we got a huge steak for only 10 bucks. This is, I'm gluten free, so I just wanted some more breakfast because I'm running out. Dude, you already know what's up. Yeah. And then I got, I'm gonna do one avocado every day for the next four days. So this is four for five. And I eat peppers every day. Now we just eat a little bit of greens and then we're good. How was it? What was your honest review? I mean, 30 buck, dude. Pretty good. I got four avocados, two peppers, these disgusting broccoli sprouts, some steak, some shrimp, and some breakfast for five days. Damn, why are you hating on the sprouts? Well, I guess I can't hate yet. Yeah, you I'll, I'll, I'll hate later when I don't like them, because I don't think I'm gonna like them. That, that thing is sick. sick. I don't even know what that is. It's an international. What is it, like a thing. scout or some shit? No. I don't know. I kind of want to hear that puppy purr up. Yeah, is it know, in line six? Should we just stare at him and wait? Yeah, awkward. Oh, oh, it's quiet. Oh no, yeah, it's, it's very quiet. Time. Four cylinder, dude. Yeah. Let's fucking start up. Yeah, yeah. The guzzler. Twenty buck, dude. Three Twenty dollars, dude. Yeah, but you got the Black Ops six. Yeah, the coupon, dude. Yeah, I got that. But I have to jock your code. Yeah, your code, dude. Catch me on. I just above, getting above a little shout out, dude. dude. That's my boy right there. Dude. I gotta find a new hobby. Why? Sixty dollars. Sixty dollars. Sixteen at O'Reilly. What? That was six. That's I've spent absurd. Hundred dollars. He thankfully gave it to me for fifty-two. He, he erased eight bucks off it. But I've spent a hundred dollars today on a racer wheel. In this. What the fuck even is that? This is just for my lower pan. I figured, like, if I'm gonna do the job, I might as well use the correct Damn. stuff. I'm pretty you sure know? they sell that at AutoZone for 16 bucks. That's crazy. Yeah, I just wanted the Motocraft, just like, that's what they use, that's what yeah, they sell for. Motocraft. They sell that too, but all Yeah, I don't think it's 16 bucks. They can't mark it up that much. Jeez. That's kind of ridiculous, though. I'm pretty Holy pissed. Holy shit. Yeah, that's. Even the, even the parts guy, he's like, whoa. Yeah, that's. Well, I'm like, let me guess. It's a lot. He's like, 60 bucks. Jeez. Like, we used to sell this stuff for 25. I'm like, yeah. So he's admitting that they're taxed. Dude, he like, he was like, oh my God. He was like, I was like, yeah. dude, how we, how do we survive in this world? Uh, you know? Be rich. I guess yeah, so. That's your only choice. Jesus be rich Christ. or be poor. There's so guys, no guys, we're coming out with this new crypto coin. No. Oh, <laughs> God, it's a pump and dump, dude. <laughs> Dang, kind of cool. Yellow golf, smart board. In the works. Oh, is it clean at least? It's super clean. Yeah, it is. It's sick. It's definitely super clean. Air induction. Thing is like spotless, dude. Yeah. Are you serious? You never see a clean Camaro like that. <laughs> we got the bug, too. Yeah. Found it on sale, dude. 32 bucks. We ended up getting two deals, dude. 70 bucks for two oil changes. Wow. Not terrible. Pretty good. Not terrible. Shout out to the Beetle again. I'm stoked, dude. Nice. I've spent now today $300 on nothing. Nothing cool. Congrats. Pissed. <laughs> I think we got a winner, dude. Pick it up by it. I mean, look, we're flexing the whole thing. No, it looks good. No, that is definitely gonna work. Wow. Not bad, yeah, dude. Dollar thirty or something from good old harbor, dude. Pretty good. The good old harbor freight. Let's get the Land Cruiser back out. Let's pop that on. We can finally show you the box. That is in fact a lot of stuff. Yo, you guys already know. We're going overlanding soon. I mean, my dream is Moab right now is just a dream. We don't have any plan. I tried to convince Trevor to do it with me. I thought we could make something happen, but I think he's pussing out, dude. Oh, Trev, I think you're pussing out, man. dude. I'm I'm over here actively moving towards it, you know, slowly, you know, but we got the tent. We got a bunch of boxes and stuff that will hopefully allow me to live off the grid for at least 24 hours. Oh, that's a large amount of time. You know what I mean? Yeah, no, I'm kidding. Yeah, no, I, I <laughs> But um, there is one mod that we do have to do. We were talking about it, how we're gonna convert the alternator to run dc oh, to dc yeah, for yeah. one of those like inverters yeah once i have that like and we can have like three or four 600 watt batteries they're 1200 
or they're twelve hundred watt. Amp hour, yeah. Twelve hundred amp Some hour. Shit like that. So twelve twenty-four. Oh, that's what it was. Yeah, Three 3, batteries at thirty-six hundred. Yeah, yep. Which that should. I mean, if you're driving, let's call it ten hours. Yeah. If those should be fully charged. Yeah. That can leave you off grid for probably three days the, with the minimal stuff that I'm yeah, gonna use. Yeah. You know what I mean? Charge your phone. And that's kind of the goal. I just want to kind of turn this thing into a cool rig that you can go out in the woods for a little bit and just live life. You know? All right. This is the exciting part. I don't. I hope I didn't overhype this because honestly, the average show this <laughs> probably isn't that cool. But for me, it's pretty cool. I love unboxings. It's always fun. It's always to fun. see what's in it. Yeah. Don't get his address. So just so you're both aware. These aren't shop chairs. There's no leaning in these. Wow. If I see a motherfucker leaning in this, I'm beating him up. Wow. I'm beating him up 1,000%. Thanks. I'm just saying. I'm not pointing any fingers. Oh, <laughs> this man. This motherfucker leans and breaks chairs, yeah, dude. There's two down. He's a chair breaker. And then he I broke the Devin's, dude. You broke Devin's. This, yeah. this is not bad, dude. This is a nice unit. Coleman, dude. Let's see, is this like insulated? You could put. Yeah, it's a little. What do you put in there, though? Well, like, like a, a cool snack? drink or something? Oh. You, know? you put a nice pack in there. You got a nice Land Cruiser and you got a fridge in there. You keep your drink cold. Yeah. You know? Put your phone in that one. So, we're not going to waste any time here. This is the same thing. Little chair. These are I'm kind of intrigued about. On the pictures, they looked a little like short. So, I'm definitely intrigued to see how this looks. Oh. In a case. Set everything up. Yeah, yeah, do like a mock yeah, stage. Yeah. No, let's go to like Green Lady then. Yeah. Let's do a fake grill out. Yeah, you know the boat ramp? Like a fake grill out or a real? No, we, we could do it for real, but we don't have a sink. I know a great place. Where? It's on a boat ramp, very secluded. Dude, no one goes good. there. Damn, what the hell is that? Dude, pretty heavy duty, right? This is crazy, dude. I don't even know what I'm looking so, at yet. It's a table. Wow. Pretty you interesting. Fucking balled out. I told you, dude. I, I've been watching van life shit for a while and although this isn't van life this is like once i traded the sci for this like i would never pay 20 grand for this because i just didn't really need it but to trade a car that was just sitting around for something that i've always kind of dreamed about doing why not right yeah i'm s this like, thing's what the kinda hell is that oh my god dude, geez. It going, dude? it's pretty cool it's looks, actually kind of sick dude looks crazy Oh damn, dude! That I'll was be like, honest though. This on a sunny day, this yeah, might it's gonna suck, be fucking dude. blinding. This might tablecloth. It's already reflecting and it's cloudy today. Oh, dude, that's sick. It's a little, like stretchy. Yeah, this is a nice that's table, sick. bro. That's and sick. And I got two of them. I could easily dice pep on that. Dude, tell me this yeah. is gangster. Uh, I'd, I'd be cutting steak on this all that's night. Nice. What the? It feels good fuck? too. Dude, when I go camp with my family, my mom's like, you know what, Chris, you did good. You know, cause. I think she expects me to go in there in absolute shamble. Yeah. I'm going to set up the tent. I already practiced. Oh we got God. the table. I'm going to have a campsite. Yeah, dude. you will. And I'm very excited Show them about that it. big box, dude. Quit oh, the, you want to see the big box? I, okay. I peaked. I peaked. Honestly, I haven't peaked. I haven't even looked at it. I don't even I know what's in there. I don't, like, I don't like looking at things until I'm actually going to like do something. Wow. Oh, Let's test the durability of this wow. table. Not bad. Bougie RV. Bougie. <laughs> Bougie. I that. swear to God, I just have like, I'm not good with razors, dude. Bougie RV, dude. I always lose them. Thank you. This is sick. Looks this, good. This is sick. I'm Looks really good. excited about this. It's a nice unit. Dude, wow. this thing is fucking sick, dude. Definitely looks sick. Now, if I was smart and not impulsive, I would have reached out to companies and like tried to get a sponsor, but. I couldn't be fucked. You paid full price. Yeah. How yeah. much was this bad, Larry? I don't know. Five hundred bucks. <laughs> That's fine. Expected a lot <laughs> let's more. Just not, let's just not talk about it. Oh you know? god, dude. No, it wasn't that expensive. I think it was like two hundred bucks. Two hundred fifty yeah, bucks. Yeah, right. Or this thing dude, I'm not lying. No, you have to plug no, it in. No, you plug it into the fucking um, cigarette. Oh. Well, yeah, it's not bad. The only thing I'm concerned about. And I did buy like a separate inverter, but I don't think it's gonna run this for too long. This is a little cheap guy. How long do you think the battery can maintain this without dying? Mm, not long. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, not you know, long like that's my fear. No, you need to get the DC to DC going. That's why I want to do that. Yeah. The only reason why I wouldn't be able to camp for more than two days is because of the power issue. Yeah. Like I could keep this thing running, but that's not efficient. You oh, know. Wow, dude, EcoFlow. <laughs> Yeah, no, so that just, defeats the purpose. I'm actually He's already fucking, glamping, dude. This is glamping. Yeah, but you're imagine glamping. running a generator. Glam camping, dude. Yeah, you're glamping. This you is think so? All this shit's glamping.
sleeping, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, well, I don't want to be some fucking guy in just a tent and a sleeping bag. Yeah, but that's authentic. Yeah, yeah, but fuck that. We're in 2024. What? No one's authentic. No one's <laughs> a fake fuck on the internet, <laughs> right? Damn. Let's just call yeah. them out, you as, know what I mean? you're a YouTuber yourself. I don't know. I, shit. I like to think how <laughs> you can tell that I'm real, you know? I don't fucking know. <laughs> fucking nice. Oh, we should probably no, blur yeah, you that can't part show out. that. Yeah, you no, you could show, show it. Just blur what I just said because yeah, that was obviously a joke, and YouTube the internet just yeah. can't take a joke anymore. No. But honestly, I guess that's kind yeah. Of this a is a huge haul. We didn't even show the grill, dude. Triton Plus, dude. China, China. Gotta I'm love them. I lost that razor, dude. I'm fucking pissed. It's about somewhere it. on the that's fucking the ground. The cats that you. Ah! It's right by. Oh, your it's foot. literally by your right toes. It's getting lost again after this. I'll be honest. I have no idea what this is. Yeah, what the fuck? I have zero idea what this is. Is that an air mattress? That's a good question. It's, it's vacuum sealed. If you open that, it might oh, expand. Oh, it's a sleeping bag. Dude. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at that. I didn't fucking fuck around. Wow. Dude. Look at this unit. Wow. Look at the bag material. What is that? Like hexagon crisis two. Yeah, that's like Black Ops 2 Crytek. Uh, yeah. Dude, let me get in this John, dude. You're gonna get in that with oh, your yeah, dirty well, ass shop outfit? Why am I dirty? Look at your back and your ass. Is it dirty? Yeah. Yeah, you're covered in leaves and All right, you're pretty clean. You get in it. You get in it. Oh my God. Get in it for me, dude. I'm gonna live through you now. Just tell me if it's nice. Why is it like this, though? It's thermal, dude. Yeah, but you're supposed to get in through the side. Nah, I like to get in like a little bean, dude. Yeah, I'm, a, a I'm a fucking green bean. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Yo, you look comfy already, dude. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So today's video is sponsored by Jeff Bezos. No. <laughs> is, uh, right here. What do you think, honestly? It's nice. It's not bad. It's nice. <laughs> what about that pillow, though? <laughs> honestly, I could sleep here. <laughs> I could easily, if it wasn't going to rain tonight, yeah. this wouldn't be bad. You could sleep anywhere. Dude. You're I always trying to I've sleep. slept in that chair yeah. by accident. I thought I got two sleeping bags, but maybe not. No, this remember. is nice. It's not bad, right? No, this is great, dude. So we got an extra chair there. We got another table just because I felt like I needed two tables. We got a grill. This is like a, the seasoning thing. Like, you know how you seasoned my pan? Yeah. I also got a cast iron pan that we've already Ooh. opened. What do you think of this? I mean, the fact that it's Lodge, I... Do I? Just say it. What's bothering you? Nothing. No, no, say it. What's on it, Nothing. dude? It's okay. It's like Canola food. oil? Is that why? Yeah. Is that not good? That's all it is. That's rice that they're labeling <laughs> it a seasoning kit. You know what I mean? So like, I bought rice, dude. Yeah, like I'm a ricer with this. So someone's gonna see this and be like, "Yeah, that dude's a rice." Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> so I would season the pan with with authentic butter. <laughs> authentic. Yeah. No, Don't you love that yeah, no, authentic butter? No, because butter. eighty percent of the butter in the store today is fake. It's margarine. Dude, come on, you can't lie. Smart butter is fire. No. Nah, no. dude. Come on, zero cows, dude. Real butter or bust. You like smart butter, right? The buddy in a fucking spray? I can't believe it's not. No, not in a spray. Never. In a you don't spray. like the spray butter? Never. Oh, I love. Dude, on broccoli, I would just fucking sit there and fucking. The thing is, you're not supposed to consume seed oils. That's what yeah. they say. It's either old country butter or. Dang, dude. I got fucking got on that Definitely one, I guess. I got on that. Nah, this is nice, though. Cast iron gets yeah, hot. Well, it's like a this fucking, is nice. Yeah. And then we got this, dude. Oh, hey. Oh, that's Dan, yeah. dude. He's ripping. Yeah, dude, that's nice. That's it's made in Cambodia, dude. Yeah, so was I. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think that's it for boxes. And then, like I said, we have the cast iron pan and shit. I'm going to now put the corner light in. There's something rattling in here. I don't know what it is. I got to figure that out, too, because I can't be that fucking idiot at the campsite rattling everything. So I got to figure that out. I'm honestly really excited for this. I'm excited that I finally did these over fenders. That was bothering me for a while. Oh, I got some more shit that's extra rice. Do we show it? I don't even know. What I got some hell of rice. Over here. Nasty ass fucking David. It's not even nasty, dude. Oil on your I got the fucking Reeboks on, dude. They're fucking Walmart special, bro. This is hella rice, what you're about to see, dude. All right, dude. I'll let you open this what stuff. What is all that? Just in case I get stranded. So I bought a life straw. Legit. Just in case, yeah, I you know? A, like, I have a bunch of those. You never know yeah. if you run out of water. I just felt like that I mean, was kind of important. Side note. You ever fucking open like an air mattress and it comes in a fucking 
bag, right? This goes back in the case yeah. hella easily. I've never yeah, I mean, I made well, every bag. time I order something off Amazon, I just make sure like all the reviews are good and stuff. And I always pick the ones that have thousands. If there's a couple hundred, not really. So that's for inside the tent, it you know. It's triple A batteries. That's fine. Go Harbor Freight, you know? Right, right. But what do you think? That's not too bad. Oh, that's good. I no. think this is the rice, dude. This is the rice. I think. Here, I'll Either open this. I'll open this. I don't know which one's the I rice. I like this color. <laughs> I like this material. Yeah. This is nice. Okay. This case is sick. A product review. Yeah, no, this is sick. <laughs> right now. No, nah, this is, oh, yeah, this isn't the rice one. This damn. isn't the rice. Yeah, not bad, right? This is sick. I think this was 20 bucks, This dude. is fucking sick. It's got a cutting sick. board. It's got all wow. of it. How's the knife, though? That's always, like, the number one thing. Let's take a look at I it. I feel like it has a lot of silverware, though. How is that thing? It's a pretty like, nice You're going to cut your steak with that? Oh, my. That's so dull. Is it? I think so. <laughs> I feel like that's kind of dull, right? Well, it's dull and thin. Sharp. Like sharp things. Yeah, you, you need gotta, to just get a stone. You gotta sharpen all yeah. that. Yeah, I mean, for 20 bucks though. Oh, that's nice. Like the fact that you have a spatula yeah, and everything is nice. Sick. I love the case. Yeah. 10 out of 10 presentation. All right, this is the rice, I oh, think. Boy. This is the rice. All right, hold on. What's in the front pouch though? I feel like uh, this surprising? was Christmas and Orion's opening like his gifts or something. Yo, this is <laughs> it sick, looks dude. like it. <laughs> if I was gifted you're this. In your, you're in your fucking socks. <laughs> yeah, dude. This morning. Is that Supreme font? Where the fuck did that come from? I think out of there. I told you we got rice dude. dude i just wanted oh, to make sure you're this is rice as yeah. <laughs> no i'm never using it dude i don't even i got gimmicks like, for sure equip gotta, this pile it. keep spinning that thing to the left dude i opened this and i was like nah i got dude, got i got got Let's for see. sure so it's supposed to be like a this is mold <laughs> This is so fucking. There's the extension, dude. I think there's like an axe in here. And the word I'm looking for is Gange. Yo, dude. Let me see this. Yeah. Let me see this fucking. You know what? <laughs> this ain't that bad. A survival kit. Yeah, dude. this ain't that bad. I figured if I was getting the life straw, Truthfully, I got the. Yeah. Like, yeah, I mean. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God damn, dude. You're just dude. practicing for the bears, dude. What the fuck, man? The, you not, ain't getting anything with a bear. No, <laughs> this nut is going to fall apart. Dude, you know they throw these out in the army because they hate them. Yeah, probably. Like this oh, look at that yeah, harpoon, that's a dude. Fucking, these, that's, this is uh, dangerous. Yeah, you just bought weapons, dude. I guess. I'm going to get in trouble. <laughs> This ain't bad. <laughs> That's no, not this bad, right? It. It's like, dude, it's... you could split logs with that. Oh, for you sure. You absolutely dude. could make a campfire with that. So, this isn't even that rice. You I'll don't give think you so? credit. No, this is. <laughs> I wouldn't buy like a one of these. Yeah, but... I think it was like 20 bucks. Yeah. And I'm like, you know what? I bought that. Let me buy oh, this, this you know? I was just excited. I was excited about my overlanding here, and shit. Here, here, nice uh, and thick. You could sharpen that. Yeah. Shovel review. Get your, oh, Damn. there's a measuring stick. Wow. You just never know if you're going to get stuck or something. Like, I feel like it's better to have something than nothing, you know? Here, let's try to make the shovel full length. I I like it. Yeah? It's it, good. It's um, not as gimmicky? No, it's a little gimmicky, but I guess if you really need, like, the multi-tool oh, aspect. This is kind of sick, dude. Nice. This is kind of sick, actually. This ain't, this ain't too, too bad. Now, do you think you can actually dig a hole with that thing? Yeah, mm. it'll be better than yeah, your hands. Not a big hole, but yeah. You yeah. Get a hole about this deep. Yeah, I mean, if you were stranded somewhere and you had to dig yourself out, like it wouldn't be so gimmick anymore. Yeah. No. This is okay. hella gimmick, dude. Ten mil, twelve mil, fourteen mil. Oh wow. You gotta dig oh compass. Here, yeah. I mean, but this is the final. Piece. Oh shit. This ain't too bad. I've actually never done this yet. What? I never put everything together. I just. Pretty cool. I wanted to do it all for a video. Yeah, that's a pretty yeah. cool tool. Look at that. You can like hit stuff with it. Not yeah. bad for the measure. Bezos gimmick, eh? Yeah, a little gimmicky, but pretty, pretty nice. Yeah. yeah. Throw it down in the comments. Would you, like, you guys think I'm crazy for buying this twenty dollar item? I like that you could like do nuts with this. Like, oh yeah. Nuts off yeah, it's yeah. kind of crazy. 10, 12, 14. Yeah. Yeah, it Not is bad. interesting. Not bad. What is this? A little saw? Yeah. yeah. Like a bottle opener. What the fuck are these? What? Oh, uh, I don't. Probably smaller than these. Yeah. Oh yeah, maybe. Maybe. It's a good. It's a good item, right? Yeah, it's not bad. It's like the day you actually need this out in the field and you don't have it, you're pissed. So See, that's like, what I mean. And for it, how small it compacts into. That's the way I looked at it because there's not good. obviously a lot of room once you add a grill, once you add that. I almost went as crazy as buying like shelving for the rear. Oh, that's for windows. Yeah. Dude, should we test it on the E30? On the E30, 36, yeah, sure. 36. No, dude. <laughs> so there you guys have it. This is um camping with Ruddy here. We're going to be testing all these products out. 
in probably about 10 days here. 10 days we're gonna be going out into the wild. I need to do an oil change and stuff on this bad girl. I gotta figure out the rattling. Just gotta put the corner light in and uh, we're gonna be ready to go. A fire starter? That might be a piece of like flint. There's no fucking... Well, hit it with the ax. No way. No, I don't want to dole that yeah, thing, dude. Doing that. Maybe with the shovel, you're supposed to strike it. No. No, I think not. you can fucking take this out, though. Oh, shit. Oh, nice, dude. Yeah. Fucked me. It might be. What if there's a tool in there? No, I don't think so. <laughs> Definitely don't think so. But yeah, no, I'm stoked. Land Cruiser's coming back. It's actually gonna be getting used. I wish I didn't go so gung-ho when I first got it and just went to the woods and all that, but we're here now. We're making it better once again, and I have hopefully have learned my lesson. Anything else anyone's gotta say? We gotta clean up Merry this mess. Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to the Land Cruiser. We're gonna hook up the fridge, and I'm gonna put a bunch of waters in it and just see how cold that actually gets. You could put this bitch into the negatives, dude. Sick. Negative eight, it goes down. Yeah, you too. could you could buy steak in bulk. On a hot night, you're gonna be sleeping on top of this thing, dude. With that nah. thing, it's not cool. No, I'm just kidding. Dude, and I was about to say, jeez. It's actually kind of cool. It tells you put meat in it, like zero. Frozen food zero. Seafood twenty six. Not bad. Water forty one. So let's pump this up to forty one then. Can you hold it? Nope. That's eight. All right, so we're at forty one. The case of water is in the truck. You want to grab that real quick? Cool? Let's see how many waters we can fit in this bad bitch. You're just I'm going to leave this thing idling? We could have just plugged this in in the shop. You do add a fair point, though. Yeah, this is putts move right now. You know what? This is this is why we're all together. We're not all there, so all, <laughs> us all together kind of works out. Yeah, we, so we, three of us together make one complete brain. Not too bad. Let's, let's this plug this bad. in the shop. <laughs> All right, so we're putting everything away right now, minus the fridge. We're gonna, where is that 41 degrees? I actually have to go look at a house real quick. By the time I get back, hopefully this thing is cold and uh, we'll test it. This thing was one of the cheaper options, the cheaper options with the best reviews. So we're gonna give this thing a good old dandy try. Dude, I actually just noticed that you drove your Miata here. I literally just noticed, that's sick. But we got a special treat. Because uh, Bailey's here. Bailey has grown up a dirt biker. Wheelie God, dude. You're telling me you could wheelie this thing? Yeah, just like, the road. Like, actually good. It might not look good, but I can go up the road on it. Like, how far? I don't know, as far as the bike goes. No, dude, really? Let me see. Let me see. Oh, fuck that, dude. Oh, he's good with it. Oh, he's good with it. Some Trevor or Devin type shit. Dude, what? I told you the Suron is way easier than the Vino. Yeah, it's just scarier. Yeah, I mean, you could pick up speed way faster, but remember how you were saying when you bail, you can't save it? Yeah. This, you can. Yeah, I guess. How, can you get 12 o'clock? I don't know about that. <laughs> so choppy. Everything. Yeah, it's sketchy, dude. It has, like, so much play in it, but, like, you can't... You Figure it out through the play. This motherfucker just hopped on it and started wheeling yeah, it? Yeah, first try. Didn't even sight lap. Let's get the Vino out. I gotta see you on the Vino. Hold up, let's get that out. All right, let's see what this motherfucker does with no power, dude. Yeah, no power, dude. <laughs> it's pretty hard. Oh, there he goes, there he goes, there he goes. It's all like you have to get the right momentum. Okay, let's see. The cars are crazy right now. Oh, geez, he's got a car right next to him, too. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, dude, it's hard. <laughs> Thanks, so I'm not too bad on the Vino. Oh, you're, you're better than he is. I'm not too bad on the Vino. Yeah. The Suron, though. He's got me on the yeah. Suron. Oh, yeah. All day. It's harder. I used to rip stock mopeds. I used to be on a wheelie. I think this thing is just down on power stock. Yeah, no, I think it's just too rich and shit. But once all the mods are done, I'm just not fucking with it because I just, Jesus, just spent all the money on it. So I'm not going to take it apart, make it run good, then take it apart again, you know? I just drilled those rollers a single rip. I already got new rollers. They're all good. Android. We're on an Android right now. A Motorola. Am I? I'm just testing the quality. Grillo just got the Razor Fold. The Razor Fold Plus, right? Uh, Razor. Uh, no, just the Razor Fold Razor uh, Plus. Twenty twenty four. 
Motorola. That's literally what I said. Well, Motorola Razor that. Plus. I'm just seeing how the camera is. I'm an iPhone guy, but I'm if I were to get an Android, it would definitely be this phone. But I'm almost looking a little laggy. But I like if you can see the phone isn't even open right now. Here, I'll show you on the real phone. Like I'm literally just filming like this, and it's super cool. Like I thought, like I'm such a bot her. I thought about running two phones to have this phone. Kind of sick, right? I we'll, we'll see what the quality is like, but we're just walking around testing it. What do you think of the quality, dude? It doesn't look very good. It's a little choppy, yeah, right? It it's a little good. choppy. Oh, Ryan's on the steak game right now. That ten dollars steak, dude. Matt's on that editing grind. What do you think? Oh, what the? Oh, here, hell? hold it. Hold it and talk to it for a minute. I don't like this phone. You don't like it? No. Why? The FPS this looks bad. Awful. Yeah, the FPS looks laggy, right? Yeah, dude. This sh is shooting like 24. We can't even use this. No, we're going to try to Google Drive it. I want to put right. it in the video. But now, oh, let me do, because they're both back cameras. So now we just move to the iPhone. Now, honestly, I mean, whether you're an iPhone or Android user, throw it down in the comments. Does the iPhone 15 Pro Max look better? Than it this. definitely is going to look better. You think yeah. so? Absolutely. Absolutely. <sighs> I love Apple how... Apple spends billions of dollars on those cameras, yeah. testing them each What year. if Motorola does too, they dude? They fucking did not. Doesn't come out laggy. Well, we're going we're gonna to put it on Final Cut and we're going to see. Maybe the front screen is just 24 FPS. Yeah. Like, no, no, no. That's the rear-facing camera. Well, yeah. Oh, oh, the, like the, the screen. The screen. Yeah, like yeah that's fair. 30 frames that's not bad. I do like the contrast. I always liked the contrast of like Samsungs or just like different phones that aren't well, so iPhone. The way the iPhones work is it's recording with all three cameras at once and then it uses AI to compile yeah. those into a higher yeah, depth. This isn't, this isn't laggy though. We're going to see. Go. Honestly, it looks good on the phone. Yeah, it's probably the Google screen. Drive it to my email. Get, no, it's not. It's pink. So this, <laughs> so this is, they have a peach no, fuzz red color. Is the case. Oh, peach fuzz. Yeah, so peach I, fuzz. I, let me take the case off. Yeah, I haven't seen it with no case. It's peach fuzz. <laughs> Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Way better color combo. Yeah, I got the peach fuzz. You they have they have a, they have, between that or hot pink. They you only had two colors? No, no, but they have four. They have green, a blue, and then like almost like a black, and then it's uh this peach fuzz and the hot pink. And like the green is okay, the blue is okay, but like hot pink brings you back to like the early two thousands, like like Barbie Girl set. So right? you went with the Barbie Girl set? No, this is peach fuzz. It's pretty Barbie Girl. Wait, have you Throw seen it down in the comments. Raise your iPhone. iPhone so it's been over 20 minutes and the Android still hasn't gotten to the MacBook. The video is completely done. We're waiting for the Android clip. So, uh. Oh, yeah, no, I fucked up. Dang, can I get a fountain? No. A okay. fountain, bro? Dang, dude. Coke Zero? I thought you, were, I thought you said something else. What? I, I don't know. I thought you did. Could you tell me? But stop it like that. Well, guys, I think we're going to end the video right here. Let's check this. This has been sitting for a while. It's not super cold yet, but it's definitely getting there. We put them in probably 20 minutes ago, so can't really expect the world. My food's about to be done. Super excited, and we're going to be doing a nice... I'm just going to call it a cast. I'm going to call it a cast. on the, Yeah, so the last one was Matt and Orion. I think it's going to be me and Orion this time. And people like the conspiracy theories. And I think it's interesting with me because I don't really know much. Yeah. So it's intriguing to hear, you know? Yeah. So I'm so follow the Patreon, 420 cast. We're filming it tonight. Yeah, I'm definitely excited. So definitely stay tuned, guys. We got some Avo here. And I'm, dude, look at that. Yeah, no, I look good. Absolutely delicious. I can't wait. So subscribe for more. We'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Oh, 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 fuck! The free coaster! Take two! <laughs>